Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Software Inc. Season 2. We are just, we're going to town on this thing. We are, we have projects that are in holding just so we can gain the revenue. We've got additional design projects rocking and rolling. We've got plenty of time on these. 58 days, 32 days. Uh, this one, we're crushing it right now. It's got 33 days left and it's doing great. Uh, let's see, Vaporbox, our game engine is almost ready to go out. We're going to be looking at a release date probably in this episode. We're going to see when the next game engine does come out. But the reason why we're building is because there are none out there. So, oh, actually we don't want the company's tab. Let's take a look and see when we could potentially release um, our game engine. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Wow, 2000. So a year from now. Oh, so I wonder because there's possibly a published Premium 2 out there currently. Well, that's Office Software. I take that back. Flyblow Kingdom has Real 3D Engine 2. Uh, let's see. I don't see anything else on here for it. But I'm wondering if the features that we have in ours weren't compatible with the previous operating system. So we're going to be kicking out a, a rocking game engine here so I want to get this out if this is gonna go out in December of 2000 I want to go probably like a May release potentially for Vaporbox I think that would give really good time for bug fixing for marketing to get everything out the door and it goes out um, shoot what almost 18 months ahead of uh, real 3d engine 2 and that should be fantastic so that should give us plenty of lead time on on the uh, game engine so let's do that I think we're gonna commit to that we're gonna do a May of 99 May of 1999 release I love it that gives us six months to release the, this engine which is great okay and look at this our revenue is doing well 4.6 million boom like look at that is just fantastic it's because we just released, uh, I want to say Vapor OS 4 has been rocking it out the gate. It's been great. Vaporworks as well has been rocking it. Vapor OS 3 is ramping down. We're almost at the point that we're going to um, kill support because we have Vapor OS 4 out. Um, these are some contract jobs, so we're going to leave these alone. We, we definitely don't want those to die, but they've got, look at that, half a million and half a million. So these two here are doing great for the, those companies. And that's that's fine. I'm definitely happy with that. Uh, Vaporbox, we got some marketing rocking and rolling right now. A press release that's going to have this date on there, so that's going to be super helpful. And then as we get closer, we'll do the typical um, the press build and everything, and get that rolling. So we're going to pay increases here um, in the very next month. That's typical for our December time frame. Uh, yeah, we are very early in TuneCube two. Uh, this is a new audio tool that we're going to put out. The core team is developing that, so I'm definitely okay with that. We'll let that rock and roll. These are um, some good jobs here. Uh, this is just paused. Um, if we hit develop, it'll actually end it. So, ooh, what's this? Oh, they just left. Well, I guess they're satisfied now. Oh, man, what do we have here? Another $4 million. Oh, goodness gracious. Let's make sure we have plenty of software out there that would be a key 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 element here um, unavoidable that is beautiful in stock 165,000 which is awesome and prominent 126,000 that is great man vapor OS 4 is absolutely crushing it uh, we had some issues here with our I think our marketing I think is what we're running into here we might have oh well this is gonna this is gonna go here right now so we'll release this we were mentioned which is great that's no, they know we're gonna release it they don't have a whole lot about us but that's fine so we're good there let's see what deal we have a design job we are plenty of those right now um, we're just gonna reject that yeah that extra um, marketing job was actually putting us just over the mark so this should actually let our reputation get back up. Uh, but good to know though, that with our other teams that we can, we're kind of at our limit right now of what we can do. 
Yep, Vapor OS 4 is doing phenomenal. Phenomenal. I love it. And look at that, 27 million. We are doing great. How are our, how are our distribution jobs? Because we had those two big print jobs, May of 99. Um, and we're doing good. Beautiful. We'll let these two ride out. That They're all say that they're on track, that we're not going to miss them. So that's good. Uh, yeah. I almost want to say, do we want to let this one go? It's got 22 days left, and we're getting 15,000 a day just for it to sit there. Eh, I'm going to say let's let it roll. Let's let it ride. Yep, look at all our marketing jobs all pegged out over here. That is fantastic. That is what we want to see. Um, programmers idle. Oh, there's our pay increases. Anything crazy? Uh, our lead. That's for the gamers team. We expect we always expect the first month that a lead is back um, after the training and everything. They want the largest increase. Then, um, six hundred twenty-two. I'm really not worried about. Uh, we'll just accept all and close. It's they average one hundred and six bucks. I mean, we have twenty-seven million dollars, guys. We are doing great. So. The meeting was great. I really think we might need to build another cafeteria. I wonder what we could change this room into. I'm thinking we might need like a, a cafeteria up here or something like that. Let them have a big space to go eat. Because we have this whole big thing down here, but they have their own. This is the Dark Ops team. Our marketing team is doing fine. They have their own down here as well. Uh, this is the gamers area so they're doing fine um yeah we are doing great see the cooks are doing their thing look pick up their food and, and also cannot complain there at all uh we are in december of 98. okay so all our support jobs are being handled very well and our reputation is all the way back up again which is what I expected we have some more uh, deals that are coming in hosting we always love to pick up hosting always goes on smoke screen we will accept that marketing I'm leaving marketing alone uh, we we know the last time we actually ran into a bit of an issue with that uh, with these guys over here so I want to make sure that we don't uh, impact our reputation too much uh, how are our servers doing? Okay, we were putting a, a good bit. We have 10 processes running on uh, smoke screen, which is only putting us at about 12% uh, utilization. So not too bad. Uh, that'll actually be uh, perfectly fine. Let's see where our largest bandwidth is. Clip light 11, 1.9 gigs. That's awesome. Because <laughs> if we go over here to our deals, if we find clip light 11 hosting, we're getting $266 per megabyte per hour. And it's using 1.9 gigs. We are just raking in money for these things. That's what I love about hosting jobs. Uh, they just, it, it's fantastic. Or is that $2.66? Uh, I think it's $2.66 per megabyte. But at a gig, I mean, we're yeah it's fantastic so um support we're gonna leave support alone we could probably pick it up i don't think it would hurt anything but we're gonna leave it alone for now one thing's to kind of settle we're gonna have some other stuff get kicked out here from our own side of the fence how are we doing 3.95 million there oh we're just rolling in okay doing super well loving it um Hmm, I'm really thinking we need to um we need to build another cafeteria. There's just not enough space. And I'm thinking if we put it right up here. Oh, we even have an elevator there. I could put another elevator here for the cooks. Yep. Give the cooks two different places that they can come in. Because uh, it'll be an elevator here, elevator here. Make this whole thing up here a cafeteria. And that'll give them plenty, plenty, plenty to work with. Okay, yep, we can definitely do that. Uh, I think that would be fine. Yeah, I'm going to 
was thinking, could we even j yeah, um, yeah, we could cover that whole thing. Hmm. That probably wouldn't take too much to do either. Marketing through design. We'll get rid of these. I'm not too worried about them right now, even though some of those are good revenue. They would be good revenue. How are we doing in the market? We have nothing that's super spectacular. We're average in each one. Uh, marketing is great. This is done. So we'll pause that, shrink it, and bring it up here. That's these two now to focus on. These two are done. I'm tempted just to knock them off the plate. That way it cleans this up. But yeah, this, this one, Bit Engine's got a whole lot. I like how we're doing the design tour for our competitor. Like, I didn't even think about this when I picked it up. Look. Oh, something dropped off. I wonder what that was. Oh, one of the marketing jobs. Just fell off because we changed months. Okay, hey. Oh, we got research. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Uh, 3D editors, audio tools, game engine, shadows. Research, that's definitely an all hands on deck. Beep. Pop that up there, get that done. We will own that, definitely. See, we're doing super well here. Now that we freed that up, I'm actually gonna do another marketing job here on, what is that, uh, vapor, uh, vapor box, yep. Mass marketers will be handling that one. Let's, uh, where are you? Right there. Low priority. It, they can take their time on it. I'm not overly worried about that. Look at this thing. Boom. We haven't even had this thing for a full day yet. Look at that 3D line just increasing. Now see, that's what it's like having a super strong team. Uh, as everyone gets trained up, as everyone's doing their thing, and we've built out these teams to be really strong. Uh, the fact that everyone is working on it, we have all hands on deck for it. Uh, we're literally clearing these things out. They're gonna complain because they're overworked. Um, we'll get the whole canteen thing done here in a minute. Uh, but tomorrow, this, actually overnight, this will probably get done. And it will. Watch this. Boom. Day one. We got it. We just researched an entire patent inside of 24 hours. I mean, this is how phenomenal you guys are. I absolutely love what you guys have, uh, how this whole team has come together, how we've uh, done super strong. So that's done now. They can focus on this one. Yep, we're complaining a lot about this canteen. You know what, we're gonna do this really quick. This is gonna be a super quick and dirty. Um, that's just a very basic. People are complaining a lot about that. So we're gonna come up here, dev mode. We'll do this really, really quickly. Um, forgive me for probably how ugly this is gonna be, but there's one bit, here's I want to keep with the uh, lines of the building as well. Um, I think that'll be really nice. Uh, let's spin this up just a little bit. I need to go this way. Because what I'd like to do as well is keep, oh, let's go here, this all the way across to there. That makes them all connected, but then I can actually put a, we can actually, we can, that's clone tool. Um, by style, um, the main office, yep, there we go, which is fine. Um, do these as well to main office, okay. So that gets the outsides green, that gets the walls done a certain color. Uh, that's done. What I wanted to do over here, I want to keep the uh, skywalk tradition going, so we're going to do full windows. Um, I think it's control, yep. Do that there, and do that there. So that's gonna be fully open. Uh, we're actually going to merge these two rooms together. 
that keeps it all open. That's what I definitely wanted. Uh, this is where the, the cooks are going to be. There's going to be an elevator here in the corner. That will open this way. There will also be an elevator here in this corner, which will open that way. And that should connect straight up. Yep. See, look at that. Yeah, we are. They're crushing the food faster than we can do it. So we're going to go um, select all in the room. We're going to say duplicate, and we're going to move this up. Oh my gosh, this would be beautiful if I can spin this around. Go like that. Select all in the room again. We're going to move this because I didn't want it quite right there. Um, so if we can go like this. Ooh. And then I want to hold shift because we're going to do this again. There's that. Oh, really? Come on. Duplicate. Thank you. Oh, did I not do that far enough? I did not. Uh, there we go. There's that. Oh, look at this. Um, we'll have to take out two of the... I'm going to move this that actually I'm okay with the aisles I, I kind of like the aisles going up what we're gonna do those we're gonna take this one and we're gonna go control and take this one we're going to sell those two because we're gonna put a doorway in right here this will allow the cooks in the kitchen here to get out and stock these but we're gonna hire we're gonna bring a bunch of cooks in Uh, let's do one other thing here real quick. We're going to duplicate this. Put it there. Uh, let's duplicate that again. Hold down shift because we have to do it two more times. There we go. Um, how do we want to do this? Do we want to do... Yep, we're going to do... Control. Beep, beep, beep. I was going to do two rows at a time, but then if we don't match up, I'd rather uh, duplicate. I'd rather um, not have to just delete that one extra one kind of thing. Look at that. That works out perfect. It gives plenty of space over here. We have nice light. Um, let's do this because they are going to super complain. Uh, let's go over here to what are we going to do? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That should be good um, for heat in this area. Let's uh, grab a couple of these fans. We'll put them over here right by the elevator. One, two, three. Okay, that should take care of that. Uh, we have plenty of plates. Let's get the kitchen decked out real quick, super fast and in a hurry. Um, it's actually taking a little bit longer than I was hoping, but we will get this. Uh, I'm gonna put this right here. The vending machine, gotta have one of those. Um, one, two, three, four. There we go. Got some lights going on in there. Cool, cool, cool. Here we go. That's canteen. Oh, kitchen. Whoops. There we go. So this is the stove. I want the stoves to be relatively close to... Okay, that means we can take six cooks in this kitchen. Uh, we'll do the fridge right next to it. One, two, three. There we go. Six, fr uh, six fridges, six stoves. Uh, there we go. 
So we're ready to rock and roll on that. There is a good old canteen. Um, oh, let's label the room. Um, this is a canteen. And I'm gonna allow anyone to go up here. I don't mind. Um, we're gonna hire a couple more cooks. Let's uh, sort this. We have a bunch of cooks. Oh, but you know what I need to do? I know what I need to do. Uh, once these guys leave, I'm gonna get rid of the uh, fridge and the stoves down here. That way they have to go upstairs. And then what we'll do is, look at that, they're gonna take all these upstairs to our new place. The employee's hungry. I know they're hungry, I know they're hungry. It's one time, they'll be, they'll be okay. <laughs> we will sell these off. This will actually turn into, let's actually limit this into a lounge. This will be the new lounge area for people. So the cook should be coming up here at the start of the next day. Let's get this uh, pivoted just a tiny bit. Um, the decor is not fantastic in here, but we can work with that. Uh, almost the start of the new day. I want to make sure this is good. We are in January. We still got a little bit of time before um, Vaporbox gets released, but that is okay. We would definitely want to get, make sure the bugs are there, marketing is there, we're working on it. Uh, let's see, that should be nice and well taken care of. Good old lounge. That's going to give uh, a place for people to sit, the couriers and stuff like that. Um, cleaning crew will come in. Man, look at that. Now that's a cafeteria. That is... I'm really happy with that, actually. That was uh, pretty quick for us to put up, and we got things ro uh, rocking and rolling there. I just want to see the cooks come in. I want to see them take care of things the way they need to. Um, there we go. Look at that. Yep. Look at that. These guys should be putting out a ton of food. No employee should go hungry again. Wow. Um, we, might, we might need to hire more cooks or spread them out. Um, do we have them anywhere else is the question. They're not here anymore. Um, see, even these guys can come upstairs to go eat if they need to. I didn't limit these rooms. Hmm, that's a good question. Oh, how are these doing now that I just dumped a whole big... Oh, we're doing fine. Okay. So the cook down, the cooks down here should be perfectly fine. This team is very, very well taken care of. We have that big meeting, rocking and rolling. Okay. Kick these out. Oh, look at that. And we're going to pause it, shrink it, bring it up here. I almost might just close those out. You know what? That's what we're going to do. We're going to end this video with closing out these jobs here. So we're going to say develop, 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 and develop. That should get us really, really good revenue there. We are going to wrap the video up uh, right there. So if you guys enjoyed this video, if you can hit that like button, that helps me huge. If you're new to the channel, I welcome you. 
I hope that the content on this channel uh, is something you guys enjoy and that you'd be uh, inclined to hit that subscribe button and just show your appreciation for what we have out there. I am humbled every time someone does hit that button. Uh, when you do, make sure you hit that bell icon, change it to all so you know when a new video or series comes out on the channel. With that being said, I thank you, and we will see you in the next video.